Hey guys, my name is Rachel. Welcome to Rachel Woolen Fitness. And today we have a cardio ab workout. All you need for class today is your mat and space to move. So you can do this workout anywhere. We are going to do an entire set of exercises one time through, and then we're going to repeat that circuit. And then we have a little blaster at the end. So let's get moving. This one's gonna be real tricky. So <laughs> you can do it though, it'll be fine. Okay, so if you have a watch, go ahead and start your watch. All right, let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna step out, same arm, same leg. Let's start on the left side. Reach it up towards the ceiling. Here we're warming up the lower half, the sides of the body, the upper body, the torso, everything. For five, four, three, two, one. Let's jack it out. So all we're doing now, just jumping jacks. If you're like, these don't feel good, you can always come right back. Stepping it out. This is cardio abs, you guys. <laughs> if you are looking to have a relaxing workout where you're not gonna break a sweat, this one is not for you. 10 more, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful, we're gonna toe tap it out. So here, actually, you're doing a little mini crunch. If you're like, I can't touch my toes, that's okay. Just reach towards them. But make sure you make a nice big circles with the arms. We're at the beginning of the workout here. Just warming up the body. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice, we're gonna come into a squat position. So our hips are back just a little bit. We're gonna move through cat and cow while standing. So drop the belly, gaze goes up, round the spine, angry cat. Really work it today. Notice how this torso is feeling. We gotta start thinking about being intentional with our movement, being intentional with our workouts. Cardio, abs, what do you think we're gonna be focusing on today? Every move that we do, I'm gonna be cueing you to focus on the abs. We're starting in the warm up. Five more. Three. Two. Ooh. Even this is a workout, you feel this? Last one here, nice. Okay, we're gonna turn those toes out, come into a nice low squat. We're just gonna move the torso around in a circle. If getting low in your squat doesn't feel good, you can always stand up a little bit more. Around the world. That's from a show. You used to be like, let's go around the world. I don't remember what it was. I don't remember. Go in the opposite direction. Three, two. Last one here. Oh, that's our warm up, you guys. All right, this is where we start those two circuits. So we're gonna get started with plank walkouts. So step to the back of your mat. Every time that we're gonna get into our plank, we're gonna do something different. So make sure that you're listening. If you need a visual, always drop down to your knees and take a look up at me. Inhale, let's reach the arms up. And exhale, take a forward fold. Let's walk it out to a high plank. If being on your hands is not good for you, you can always come down onto your forearms, okay? Always an option for you. We're just gonna hold here for another 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, five, four, three, two, one. Leg lifts, lift left and right, left, and right. I do not want these legs just to fly up in the sky. Hold that belly button in towards your spine for five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Walk those hands back. Ooh, bend the knees. Roll on up to standing. Reach the arms up and overhead. Let's go right into it. Forward fold. Plank walk out again. Walk it out. High plank. This time, we're gonna step the feet out to the side. So step right foot out, left. Right, we're working the obliques now, right? Feel it, squeeze it. 
Keep going. We got five, four, three, two, two, and one, and one. Nice. Send it back. Walk those hands back. Forward fold. Bend the knees. Roll on up to standing. And let's take a forward fold. Let's go for it. Come on. Walk it out. High plank. Now, plank jacks. You can continue to step one foot out at a time, or if you so choose, hop it out. We got eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Send it back down dog. Walk the hands back. Big bend of the knees. Roll on up to standing. Reach the arms up and overhead. And forward down. Forward fold down, sorry. <laughs> Okay, this time we're going to bring that right knee straight back and then knee to nose. One time, then left foot, knee to nose. There's eight and eight. Seven. Seven. Oh my gosh, this is probably the hardest one. We're already tired. Six. Five. Five. Four. Four. Three. Three, two, two, one, and one. Beautiful. Send it back. Walk those hands back. Roll on up. We have one more here. Reach the arms up and overhead. Forward fold. Let's come down. What do you think we're going to do? Mountain climbers. All right, get the booty down. We only have 10. Let's do it. Here we go. 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 7, 6, 5, 5, 4, Three, three, two, two, one, one. Beautiful. Send it back. Big bend of the knees. Roll on up to standing. Reach the arms up and overhead. Grab onto one of your wrists. Take a side bend. Okay. We're coming into our side planks here. Switch to the other side. Options, okay? Whew. You feel that in your arms? Ho, ho. Okay. All right, so come on down to the floor. Once again, if being up on your hand does not feel good, you can always come down onto the forearm, okay? Then, for your side plank, there's other options here. You can either stack the feet one on top of each other, or you can stagger and have that top foot in front of the bottom foot, okay? So find what feels best for you. We're gonna do some arm carves, okay? So, pick a side, I don't care which side you're on, Top arm is going to reach up towards the sky. Bring that arm down. You're carving the floor underneath you, and then you're lifting back up. That's one. We got ten. Here's nine. Oh, these are nice and slow. If you need to take a break, take a break, but come on back with me. Oh, I'm already sweating. I'm feeling it. Here's six. Five. Four, three, two, last one here. Beautiful, drop the hips to the floor, take a moment, breathe. <laughs> but actually breathe, okay? Don't just like do what I did. If that breath is getting away from you, I know this is challenging. This was challenging right from the get-go, but you got this, okay? Come back into our side plank. This time I'm going to opt to come down onto my forearms because I know it's coming next, okay? <laughs> so get the hips off of the ground. Reach that top arm up and overhead so the fingertips are reaching towards the top of the mat. Bring that top knee into your elbow for 10. Nice. Squeeze those obliques. Here we go. Eight. Seven, six, don't let those hips fall to the floor. Five, halfway there, come on, here's four. Three, two, we're gonna stay lifted here. Bring that hand on top of your hip, we're gonna hip down to the ground and up. Nine, squeeze those lower obliques. Those are the ones doing the majority of the work here. We got six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Beautiful. Drop it down. Let's switch to the other side. Yeah, 
cardio abs, do you feel that? Do you know why I, I'm calling this cardio abs? <laughs> You're like, yeah, I get it, cool. Okay, yep, carbs. We're gonna carve it out on the other side, so get yourself set up. I neglected to mention this on the other side, but make sure that that shoulder is stacked on top of your elbow, on top of your wrist, okay? Hips, the tendency for them is to have them fall back and drop towards the floor. Keep those hips stacked on top of each other. Use your core, squeeze, okay? Top arm reaches up, here we go. We're gonna carve it out. And one side is definitely gonna be harder than the other, that's for sure. Here's six, five, four, three, two, last one here, one, nice, let's drop those hips down to the floor, Whew. shake it out a little bit, okay, you know what's coming on the other side, right, we got this, we got this, easy peasy, I'm going to come down onto my forearm on this side, all right, top arm is gonna reach up and overhead. Make sure that those hips are lifting off of the ground. Shoulder is still stacked on the elbow. Let's do it, bring that knee into your elbow. Ooh. Nine, eight, seven. I'm with you here, six, I'm doing this. Five, Ugh. four, three, Two, stay lifted here. Do not drop down. Stay lifted. Bring that hand onto your hip. Lower up and down for 10, 9, 8. I know the heart's pumping. 7, 6. Squeeze the abs. 5, 4. Come on. 3, 2, 1. Drop it down. Oh, holy, holy. All right, cross one of the arms over. Stretch it out. We're almost done with this round of the circuit, okay? Switch sides. Whew, you feel it in your arms too, huh? And potentially even in your booty. Yeah, that was intentional. Okay, let's stand on up. Take a sip of water if you need to as I explain our next move. All right, feet are gonna be about hip distance apart, maybe a little bit wider, but toes are facing forward. We're squatting down for four counts and then up, okay? So your squat, your booty should be coming back because your heels should be behind your toes. We're not squatting with the heels in front of the toes. Booty gets back. You're holding that belly button in towards your spine the entire time. Four counts down, four counts up, 10 times. Got it? Got it, okay, cool. Let's do it. So squat position, let's squat down for four, three, two, one, lift up. I'm actually gonna count on my hands, that way I don't make us do more than we have to, right? <laughs> Here's three. And up, two, three, four, down. Squeeze those inner thighs together, and up. It's like an energy thing, okay? You're not actually squeezing the inner thighs together, you're energetically squeezing them together. We're halfway there, come on, here's six. And up, two, three. You're starting to feel this, it's a slow burn. And up, we have only three more, we go down. And up. And down. And up, two. Last one, here's down. And up. And then we're gonna go right back down, two, three, four, and hold. Hold, 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 okay? We got this. Form, check yourself here. When we get tired, those knees wanna come forward. All of a sudden, we're hunching the back. Get the booty back, hug the belly button in towards your spine, and lift up your chest. This is hard, but you can do this. Get a little bit lower in your squat. Because once again, you are strong, you can do this. Mini pulses up, here we go. Every time that you lift up, think about exhaling. Shh, shh, shh. You're squeezing the abs every time that you lift up. We got five more. Four, three, two, one. Nice, stand it up. Good, 
Ooh, that heart rate is lifted. Okay, turn these toes out to the side. Same thing here, we're gonna go down for four, and then up for four. Here we go, let's go down, two, three, four, up. Nice, you go down, two, three, four, up. Nice, down, I think run three, up. <laughs> down, up. It's like you're opening and closing a zipper. Opening the zipper, two, three, four, zip it up. And down, and up, and down. This next one's a doozy. Oh, yes. Down. And up. Two more. Down. And up. Down. And up. What we're going to do now, we're going to come down and we're going to jump. Down and jump. Ten times. Join me when you're ready. I'm on three, four, Five, six, toes are turned out to the side. Three more, eight, nine, ten, stay low. Whew. Okay, check yourself here. Toes are turned out, open up those inner thighs, hands come behind the head. We're gonna do oblique crunches. If you need to stand up for a hot second, do it. And then come right back into it. If you want to have one hand on your abs to really feel if you are crunching the obliques, do it. We got three more here. Here's two. Last one. Nice. Okay, stand on up, shake it out. What are we doing next? I forgot. Okay, this will be fine. This will be fine. We'll be good. Okay, squat position. Toes. Facing forward, they're about hip distance or a little bit wider apart. We're going to squat and then kick back. Okay, we're doing 10 right leg kickbacks in a row. Come on. Every time that you are lifting this leg back, squeeze your abs. Here's five. We're halfway there. Six. Squeeze. I know we're working the booty, right? But what's helping you get that leg back? Your abs, your back. Nine, here's 10. Let's keep it here, hold it. I have a slight hinge forward. I'm straightening through that standing leg. Both hips are reaching towards the front. We're not opening up to the side. Okay, lift that right leg a little bit higher. We're gonna pulse it up and back. Every time that you are lifting that leg, squeeze the air out of your belly. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. For five, four, three, two, one. We'll go right back into it. Other side. Squat and then lift. Squat and lift. Squat and lift. Whew. Come on here. I know we're getting tired. We are almost done with this first round. <laughs> we gotta do all this again. Who made this workout? Oh, my Lanta. Whew. Let's do four more here. Here's four. Three. Two. Last one. Hold it up. Stay here with me. Chest, keep it lifted. It can hinge forward a little bit. Hug that belly button in towards your spine. Get that leg a little bit higher. Ready to pulse it out? Come on, let's do it. Here we go. We got 20. 14, 13, 12, 11. Every time you lift that leg, squeeze that belly button in. For five, four, three, two, one. Nice plie squat. Let's come right back into it. Hold low. You guys are going to hate me. Bring your hands behind your head. All right? Keep those legs nice and wide. We're going to twist and twist, and twist, twist. That heart is pumping, I know it. Cardio, abs. According to my, my Fitbit, I'm actually in the fat burning zone. <laughs> I get to that zone fairly quickly. You might be there too, which is awesome. 
We got four more here. Four. Here's three. Three. Two. Really twist. Last one here. One. And one. Beautiful. Stand it up. All right. Shake it out, you guys. We'll give ourselves 30 seconds here before we hop back into it. Take a sip of water. You can do this. You've already done it once. You have literally already done it once, okay? Good news for you, we're not gonna do the warm up again. <laughs> so we're just gonna start with the plank walkouts. All right, we got 10 more seconds. Feeling good? Come on, this is the time. This is the time where you can say, I'm gonna quit or I'm gonna continue doing this. Don't quit, continue doing this. You can do it, I'm doing it right along with you, okay? Okay, plank walkouts. Let's do it. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, take your forward fold. Look it, it's like a nice little stretch. Walk it out to a high plank. Hold here for 10 seconds. Nine, eight. Hug that belly button in towards your spine for four, three, two, one. Leg lifts, lift right and left. Nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, last one. Nice. All right. Down dog. Walk those hands back. Big bend of the knees. Roll on up to standing. Aren't you glad we're getting these plank walkouts done at the beginning? Take a forward fold. Coming up next, we got the step outs. Walk it out to your high plank. Step one foot out at a time. Here we go. Ten. Squeeze those obliques. Seven. Six. Five. Can you step those toes a little bit higher out to the side? Three. Three. Two. Two. One. One. Nice. Down dog. Walk those hands back. Big bend of the knees, rolling up to standing. I want you to take a moment here. Connect with that breath. We've got plank jacks, okay? When we get down to the bottom here, we only got 10 of them. Inhale, reach the arms up. My arms are jello. <laughs> Forward fold. Let's walk it out. High plank. Plank jacks. If you're ready for it, ready? Let's do it. Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 6. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Down dog, walk those hands back. Big bend of the knees, roll on up. Reach the arms up. Forward fold. <laughs> okay. Walk it out, high plank. We're doing knee to nose, okay? So right leg, right knee comes up to your nose and extend. Left, extend. Nine, nine, eight, Seven. If you need to take a break, hop back to hop back to child's pose. Words, words. All right, come back up. We got four more. Four, three, three, two, two, one, one. Nice. Send it back to down dog. Walk those hands back. Big bend of the knees, rolling up to standing. We got next mountain climbers. That's it. Then we're done with these silly, silly plank walkouts. Okay. Let's do it. Mountain climbers, we got 10 of them. Come on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. This time just send it back to child's pose. Cardio abs. All right, let's come forward here. Side plank. Let's get right on into it. Lift that left arm up or whatever arm's on top. Carve it out. Come underneath and then lift. You know your limits if your form is starting to get saggy, okay? Or your hips are falling back. Modify. Come down onto your forearm. Maybe you even have one leg bent and one leg straight. Modifying here. Nothing wrong with that. Let's do two more. One, 
Nice, okay. I'm gonna come on down onto my forearm for this next one because we gotta bring our elbow to our knee. Knee to elbow, ready? Arm reaches up and overhead. Let's do it, knee to elbow. Nine, eight, that shoulder is stacked on top of your elbow. Five, four, exhale, three, two, one. All right, hand comes on top of your hips, lower down and up. Nine, use those lower obliques. Here's six, five, four, three, two, last one here, and lower it down. Switch to the other side. I know, I'm going right on into it, you guys. I don't want to continue doing this longer than I have to. Let's stack those feet. Arm reaches up, let's carve it out. Here's 10. Get those hips lifted. Don't let them sink. Lift them up. Here's six, five, four, three, two, last one. All right, come down onto your forearm if you want to or stay lifted. We're gonna bring that knee to the elbow, elbow to the knee for 10, nine, eight, seven. Come on, keep those hips lifted. Keep them stacked, one on top of each other. Do not let it fall back. Here's four more, four, three, two, one. Hand comes on top of the hips, lift it down and up. Squeeze it out. I know this is painful, but you know what? Change will not happen overnight if you don't put the work in. Five, four, three, two, last one here. Lift, lower down. Man, you deserve that round of applause. Are we doing okay? Shrug it out, shrug the shoulders back. I know they're working hard, shrug them forward. Cardio abs, all right, we, what's it called? Bind the hands behind your back. I'm like, words, I don't know. Okay, we're getting into our squat sequence here. Okay, take a sip of water if you need to, get in that mindset. This time around, we're going faster, okay? We're going right into the next thing. So squats, four counts down, four counts up, 10 times. When we're done, we're gonna hold it down there and then we're gonna pulse it, okay? Mindset, you got this, you've already done this once before. You can do it again, right? Right, okay, let's go. Down, up, that's one, down, up. Energetically, we are squeezing the inner and outer thighs together. When we go down, we are sinking the booty back, but we're hugging in that belly button in towards your spine. We go down and up, halfway there, down. I'm shaking up, <laughs> come on, down. Here's number seven, and up, eight. And up, nine, and up, last one. We're gonna finish it out, come up, then we go down, hold it here. Okay, we're gonna get tired. That shoulders, or the shoulders are gonna try to round forward. Keep them lifted, get low, use your core, use your back strength to keep you from sticking your booty out, okay? Stay intentional, even when things get hard. Get a little bit lower in your squat. <sighs> Mini pulses, let's go. 20, 17, 16, 15, 14, <sighs> nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice, stand it up, shake it out. Ha ha ha. Okay, everything is connected. 
Turn those toes out. Nice wide squat here. We're going to go down. Two, three, four, up. Okay, down. You're like, how is this affecting my abs? My abs are not actually engaged. They should be. Squeeze that belly button in towards your spine this entire time. Literally, have one hand on your abs and feel. You might even feel it more when you're lifting up, but I encourage you to engage those muscles. Okay? We're halfway there. Yeah, I'm exhaling on my way up. And I actually feel that. I feel my abs contracting. And up. We've got two more here. Down. And up. Last one. Down. Then we got ten jumps. Up. Two, three. Here we go. We go down and jump. Landing nice and softly. Okay? We're not elephants. <laughs> okay? So land on the balls of your feet. Then your heels follow. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Stay low. Bring the hands behind your back. Oblique crunches for ten. If you need to stand up, go for it. Eight, eight, seven. Squeeze those obliques. Squeeze, squeeze. Five, five, four, four, three, two, two. One, one, stand on up, shake it out. Are you ready for this, you guys? I don't think you can handle it. Woo. Okay, get low in your squat again. Toes are facing forward, hips go back. All we're doing here, oh yeah, wrong one, sorry. All we're doing here is we're gonna take a squat and then a kick back. Okay, same leg, 10 times. Every time that you kick that leg back, squeeze the abs. Oh, yes. Halfway there. Here's number five. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Last one here. We're going to keep it lifted. Hold. Check the hips. You should not be... Opening up to the side, hips are square, chest is slightly hinging forward, belly button's hugging in towards your spine. Get that leg up a little bit higher. Every time that you're going to pulse that leg up, exhale. Here we go. We got 20. 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Drop it down. Right into the other side. Squat and lift. Squat and lift. Squat and lift. That's four. One more, then we're halfway done. You guys, then we just got these plie squats. Got to pump it out here. I need to concentrate or I'm going to fall over. Eight. <laughs> Nine. Ten. Come on, keep it lifted. Hold. Same thing here. Belly button in, chest lifted. You're hinging forward slightly. Lift up that back leg a little bit more. As I mentioned, we got plie squats after this. Plie squat twists. Got our slight little burnout, and then we're stretching it out. All right, let's pump it out. Pulse, pulse. Exhale every time that you lift that leg up. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Step it down, wide squat. Come down, bring the hands behind your back, and you twist. Twist. What I don't want to see happen when you twist is that same knee or that same thigh comes forward. Keep your thighs open as you twist. The twist is coming from the upper body and the torso, not the hips, okay? Who's keeping count? What is that? Five, five, six. I need an assistant in here. Eight, two more on each side. Nine, nine. Here's 10. 
and 10. Beautiful, take a forward fold. Turn those toes forward. Shake it out here. All right, we're coming onto the floor for some bridges. Okay, don't be mad. Heel toe the feet together so you're in a forward fold. All right, big bend of the knees. Come on down onto your mat. This is it. We have three exercises with our bridges, and that's it. We're stretching it out, okay? Capiche? Capiche, okay? So come on down onto your back. Make sure that those heels are close to your bum that you can actually tickle your fingertips, okay? We're going to lift the hips up for four and down for four. We're doing this on the ground so you can actually see your abs engaging, okay? So we're gonna lift up, two, three, four, down. That is one. Up, two, three, four, down. That's two. Lift up, two, three, four, down. Yes, we're working the booty. Up, two, three, four, down. That's four. Here's five. So you are squeezing the booty, but I also want you to be squeezing your abs. So squeeze the inner and outer thighs together. All of a sudden, your abs are engaged. Up, two, three, four, down. Two, three, four. Here's eight, two, three, four, down. Here is nine, four, down. Last one, up, two, three, four, down, two, three, we're gonna hold it up. Okay, so get those hips up. Up, 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 up. Get them higher than you've gotten them so far. We're gonna do hip dips, okay? So left hip is gonna come towards the floor and then you lift up. Right hip comes down and up. Left and up, right and up. Here's three, three, and four, oh, four. I really want you to get those hips covering or even tapping the ground. Squeeze them up and up. Keep the feet making contact with the mat the whole time. Down and up, down and up. Come on here, we got two more on each side. Down and up. Down and up, last one, down, up. We're gonna hold it up. I know, I'm a cruel, cruel person. Come on top of the tippy toes if it feels good for you. Get those hips up a little bit higher. Squeeze that belly button in towards your spine. We have 20 pulses up towards the sky, that's it. Ready, here we go. 20, 19, 16, 15. Squeeze the belly button in towards your spine. You're exhaling every time that you lift up, 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 up. Here's seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop it down. Legs long, reach the arms up and overhead. Not bad, you guys. Not bad at all. Cardio abs, full body abs. <laughs> you can't really do cardio without getting the entire body involved. So yeah, sorry about that. All right, roll over onto your belly. <laughs> but we brought so much intentionality to our abs. We're in Cobra. Maybe you even want to bring those hands by your lower ribs and press up. Send it back to child's pose. And you know, strong abs, that's not the only component of having strong abs. You know, those six pack abs that we all want. You need a strong back as well. You can't really have one without the other, unfortunately. Let's press up to a tabletop position. Step one foot forward so you're in a low lunge. You can bring the hands on top of that thigh, send the hips forward. Nice. This was a good one, you guys. I hope you stuck with it. Let's switch sides. Step the other foot forward. 
And then press the hips forward. Full body, cardio, ab focus. Nice. Nice. <laughs> All right, bring the hands down to the floor, tuck the back toes, come into a forward fold. And wiggle your hips side to side, stretching out the backs of the legs. Let's take a big bend of the knees and let's roll on up to standing. Reach the arms up and overhead and grab onto one of your wrists, take a side bend. Whichever way that you are bending, send the hips over in that direction as well. And then open up your chest towards the ceiling. And back center, other side. And back up. Oh, nice work, you guys did it. Oh my gosh, you killed it. Thank you so much for working out with me today. Go out there, you guys. Be fierce, be playful, and I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.